Okay class, we had just finished early, so you will have 5 minutes of free time before lunch. Remember, don't cause any form of trouble in this classroom, or else you'll be sent to the headmaster's office. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm going to use the bathroom, so I'll be right back. God, I'm feeling so bored, all I can do is just sit at my desk during free time for 5 minutes. I wish I could do something entertaining, but what can I do? I know, I'm going to play with my soccer ball in this classroom, I will show my classmates some cool soccer ball tricks, it's going to be a lot of fun. But first, I'm going to get my soccer ball from my backpack. There, I got my soccer ball from my backpack, now, time to show my classmates some cool soccer ball tricks with my soccer ball. Hey guys. Check this out, I'm going to do some cool soccer ball tricks with my soccer ball. Wait Drew, you can't do some soccer ball tricks with your soccer ball in Mr. Richardson's classroom. Yeah Drew, Mr. Richardson's classroom is not a soccer field, you can hit someone or even break something if you do that here. I strongly agree with Dallas and Ryan. Me too. Me three, so you must put your soccer ball back in your backpack right now. Come on guys, my soccer ball tricks won't be that bad. Watch this. Ouch. All right, someone had a soccer ball and he or she was playing with it by doing some soccer ball tricks in my classroom, and I just got hit in the face right when I came back from the bathroom. Who was doing this? Was it you, Drew? Yes, Mr. Richardson. It was me. I just wanted to show my classmates some cool soccer ball tricks with my soccer ball, because I was bored from just sitting at my desk. I'm so sorry. Drew, this is a classroom, not a soccer field. You are never ever allowed to play with your soccer ball especially doing soccer ball tricks in my classroom. You just hit me in the face by doing that. That does it. Surrender your soccer ball to me, then go straight to the headmaster's office now. Well, my soccer ball tricks were so good while it lasted at the headmaster's office. So Drew, how did you end up here in my office? Well, Principal Michael, I was playing with my soccer ball by showing my classmates some soccer ball tricks in Mr. Richardson's classroom, and I hit my teacher Mr. Richardson in the face with my soccer ball, that's how I ended up here. Drew, Mr. Richardson's classroom wasn't a soccer field, you cannot play with your soccer ball in a classroom, because you can hit someone or even break something by doing that, for this, you will be suspended from school for the entire week, now, I would like you to exit the school building and go home and they will contact your parents. Drew, your headmaster has just contacted us, and he told us that you were playing with your soccer ball by doing some soccer ball tricks at Mr. Richardson's classroom. You know that Mr. Richardson's classroom is not a soccer field. Your dad is right, Drew. You cannot play with your soccer ball at a classroom at school, because you can hit someone or even break something by doing that. For this, you'll be grounded for the entire week, Head to your room right now and think about the proper time to play with your soccer ball. God, it's not fair.